In this walkthrough, I'm going to explain to you how to log on to a server using Secure Shell, how to change directories, create a new directory, create a simple file using the built-in editor, test it, and log out again. So we'll start off by logging in. If you're using a Linux or Mac machine, as we are here, you'll be able to use the terminal application. If, however, you're using a Windows machine, you will have to download and install an application called Putty, P-U-T-T-Y. Now to log in, we first of all use the Secure Shell program, and we specify the username, then the at sign, and then the name of the server. When I press enter, it's going to ask me for the password. password isn't echoed on the screen for security purposes, but as you can see now, we are now logged in. And the first thing I'm going to do is use the ls command to see what's in the current directory. So I type in ls, and as you can see, nothing appears on the screen, because we have no folders and no files. If I want to find out the exact path I am on the server, I type in pwd, the print working directory. And you can see that I'm in slash home slash virgo r203km. If I type in clear, it will clear the screen and give me a blank screen to work from. The next step is I'm going to create the folder to put my web files in. By default, the Apache web server is looking for a folder called public underscore html. And as you can see, it's not there at the moment. So let's create it. MKDIR means create a directory, public underscore HTML. And with a Linux or Unix system, if you get no feedback from the system, it means the command's been successful. If I type in ls again now, you can see the folders listed. So I'm now going to change directory and move into that particular folder. So I type in cd public now. I don't have to type the whole command in because there is an autocomplete. If I press tab at any point, it will complete the command for me. And now you can see in the prompt, it now says tilde, which is the home folder, slash public underscore HTML. And that's the folder I'm now in. And of course, the folder should be empty. And it is. So my next job is I'm going to create a simple HTML document. And I'm going to use an editor called Nano. So let's have a go. I type in Nano and the name of the file I want to create. And now I'm in the Nano editor. And I can simply type in what I want to, want to uh, create as a web page. And as you can see, the colour's complete for us. And I'll just put a simple message on the screen saying, hello world. Like so. And the title I'll make Hello World. Like so. And that's the page finished. To save it, if you look at the bottom of the screen, the key commands are there. Write out means save, so I press Control O, file name to write, index.html, and I press return, and it saved the file. And I can now type in Control X, and that takes me back to the folder and out of the editor. If I now type in ls, you can see there's my index.html file. So let's go to the web browser and see if we can see that. Now the important thing is, <coughs> can you see that we have the username at the start there? I'm going to copy that. And when I go to the editor, I type in creative.coventry.ac.uk, then I put forward slash, then a tilde sign, and then my username that I've taken from my login, my username to log into the system. And if I press return now, there's my page displayed. 
And by default, if you don't put the name of the file, the file it will assume it's index.html. So I can put index.html and get the same page. So my last two jobs are, I'm going to go back up to the home folder again. And to go up a level, we use two dots. LS again, and you can see public underscore HTML. And before we quit, I'm going to change my password. And to change your password, which you must do when you first time you log in, you type in P A W S W D and press enter. I have to enter my old password once. And I enter the new password twice. And my password is now changed. And to finish off, I'm going to exit to quit the secure shell connection. And that's now finished.